So in the Shuri comic series, before she takes on the mantle of the Black Panther, she actually becomes Groot. In this story, T'Challa has gone missing on a mission to space, and the Wakandans want Shuri to become the Black Panther until his return, but she declines. However, she still searches for her brother, as she attempts to find him through astral projection, next to a tree named Groot Boom. Storm ignites the tree as Shuri's body is sent off into space. She sees T'Challa's ship, however, she finds her mind sucked into the body of Groot. We see Shuri explain herself to Rocket as she has an internal dialogue with Groot. They're interrupted by a giant space mantis, who's the main antagonist for this series. Shuri yells Wakanda forever as Groot, and attacks the mantis. After they've defeated the creature for the time being, Groot tells Shuri about the connection he feels with a tree in Wakanda, and that tree says it may be better for her to lose instead of finding what she's looking for. She takes this as the tree telling her to give up on T'Challa, and leaves Groot's body, with the mantis creature now knowing where she is. 